In July 2018, Israel's Knesset approved the nation-state bill, a controversial piece of legislation, both at home and abroad, which declared Israel a sovereign state for the Jewish people. It followed U.S. President, Donald Trump's 2017 decision to relocate the United States Embassy, from Tel Aviv to Jerusalem. Both events provoked consternation, and scorn from many countries, and offer the latest twists in the Israeli-Palestinian saga, two peoples on an everlasting, and seemingly irreconcilable, path to peace. Israel and Palestine, the complete history seeks to explain, the overall story of Israeli and Palestinian tensions, and divisions in the region. Indeed, without properly, understanding the full history of the area, it is impossible to understand the current situation. In this book, author Ian Carroll, takes the listener back to the very beginning of the conflict, some 4,000 years ago, then moves through the major events of the Middle Ages, and 20th century, and brings us right up to the present day, documenting the significant events that have happened along the way. The listener is allowed to make up their own mind as to where praise, and condemnation belong with this complicated issue. From Exodus to the birth of Jesus, from Islam to the Crusades, through the diaspora, and up to the recreation of the modern state of Israel and beyond, Israel and Palestine, the complete history avoids a dry academic approach. It aims to tell the history of the region, and peoples in a balanced and brisk fashion, from a storyteller's perspective. With talk of a third intifada, and the introduction of the nation-state bill, all bringing this age-old issue to the forefront of world news once more, there has never been a more appropriate time to understand, and appreciate Israel and Palestine's history. This book is currently paid, but you can watch a tutorial right after this introduction, to get it for free and legally. In this video, we will show you how to get this book for free and, most importantly, legally. All you need to do is to follow this video until the end. As always, if you enjoy our content, don't hesitate to subscribe so you won't miss any of our new videos. So, to get started, you will click on the links right below this video and you should land on the same website as mine here. Here you have all the details of the book. Rest assured, all you need to do is click here to try Audible for free, which is right here. You don't need to do anything else, everything you see here is just the details of a subscription, so we will click here. And then, for those who already have an Amazon account, you simply need to sign in and we'll see you at the other end of the video. For those who don't have one, we will create one here. And here, you need to enter your name, your email address or phone number, your password, knowing that all the information you enter here must be real because you will need to identify yourself with these details. After entering the password, you need to retype it once again for confirmation. Once you have entered everything, you will click on verify email address. Then, the site wants to make sure that the person registering is not a robot. We will click right here and each time, we will need to click on the image that seems to be the most correct. Now that's done. The next step is to verify the email address. So we'll go to our inbox. Ok, here we are in the mailbox. And there it is the email for Amazon verification. 
You enter and copy this code, the verification code we received, and you will click on verify. Now, we are going to add a mobile phone number. Choose the country code and enter your number. Once that's done, we will apply it here, and we will enter the verification code that was sent to our phone number, then click on create your account. Here, you won't be charged for anything. To reassure you, you can use a debit card that is empty or simply has zero euros. You have two options. Either you keep the subscription after 30 days, that's when you will be charged, or you cancel your subscription right away and keep the book that was offered to you, knowing that your account will not be deleted. Now we're going to click here on confirm. There you go, your account has been created. We just have to go to audible.fr. You're going to type audible into Google. You click here on the first site here at the top, we are already connected to our account, we are going to go to library and there. We found the book which is complete. You can download it, listen to it, it's up to you to make your choice. You can listen to it directly on audible.fr, or download it here. Now, how do we cancel our subscription? You will see that it is very simple. Here is the book that can be downloaded. Ok, you are going to click here on my account. And there you have it, it is on this page that we will cancel our subscription. We're going to go down a bit. You see, we are going to click here to cancel my subscription. then continue. And there, he asks us for the reason, we will click on, another reason and we will write, no reason. Then click cancel subscription. And there they want to promote us to stay, we will click on cancel. There it's done. The subscription will be automatically cancelled after 30 days and that's it, knowing that we still have our account. We still have the book as a gift. We are going to return to the home page, the library. And there, you see that we still have the book here, we can listen to it or download it. You have nothing else to worry about. I think we've done the trick. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. If you ever like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe, we'll be very happy.